Alright, and I know what you I know what you can press. Are you ready? Click to continue. Go to consume. <laughs> and then self. <laughs> that is physically impossible. <laughs> 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 Nom 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 nom! I you taste eat it. yourself in an anger. ICOM Simulations Incorporated presents Uninvited 1988 ICOM Simulations Incorporated Greetings, this is Doomguy here, and welcome to Let's Play Uninvited for the Apple II GS. And joining <laughs> here tonight is... Uninvited. Yes. Yeah, I hate to break it to you, but I found one glaring error with that opening. You said Let's Play, not We Play, but then again, I came up with a... Uh, he's stealing it. But, on the positive side, at least we're all here, and that's the only inconsistency that I have found so far, and I don't plan on looking for any more. Let's get on with the show. Yes. <laughs> okay. All right. Yes. yes. All right, so. Yes. Morning. Invited. Wait, Rock Rage. I, I have a better. Good morning. <laughs> <laughs> You've been summoned as the uninvited. Look out. Look out, Pete to Steve. The last thing that you remember before the darkness rushed up to claim you... Oh god, Banjo. ...is your brother's startled cry. You managed to swerve around the shadowy figure that appeared in the roadway, but lost control as the car jumped the shoulder and plunged headlong into this tree. You sound like Foxy oh. from How to Make Fine at the Phrase Not Scary. Swiveling your battered head as you survey the wreckage. You realize that you were alone. Your camper must have gone off. I'm sorry, dude. I just wanted to let you know the pizza's ready. Uh oh! To get you some help. Computer's on fire. <laughs> as you pry yourself, as you pry yourself free of the steering wheel's embrace, you can't help but notice the pungent odor of gasoline as it leaks from the ruptured gas tank. Oh, so that's the gasoline. That's yeah, now, um, let's get the hell out of here. That's the gasoline that we heard. It was burning. The car door opens with some effort. The accident has caused some damage. To You hear this? You hear the pitter patter of your wallet burning. For there you. is a mighty explosion behind you as your car bursts into flames. That will at least save you the cost of a tow. Better try to find your younger brother and have him call a cab instead of a tow truck. It's Jesus gonna, Christ! This is just like Silent Hill. It's gonna be sad. It's gonna be sad because he doesn't have insurance on that car. You stand at the front porch of a house. This old Gothic mansion casts gloomy shadows all around you. A sharp wing cuts through your flesh to chill your bones. The pounding thunder grows louder and more threatening. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes, the chilling wind blows. <laughs> what? what? Did I do? That, that the wind blew through right through your spine. <laughs> and the fucking vacuum cleaner in the background. <laughs> <laughs> the mailbox is now open. Watch out! The vacuum will get them letters. <laughs> okay, so let's just go ahead and the chilling and, wind. And In let's uh, examine this. Bad. Note reads, Dear Master, Please forgive me. My health prevents me from aiding you in your battle against the evil one. You teach your students well. They become too powerful for their own good. Enclosed is an amulet that should look familiar. Will this charm and think of me. The undead feels symbology. Still the evil. Set it free for the sake of family. This is practically we'll turning into Harry this is practically going to become in Harry Potter right now. No, this was think before about it, Harry yes. Potter was a thing. No, no, Doomguy agrees with me, it is Harry Potter. This was the, this was the inspiration for Harry Potter. <laughs> <laughs> J.K. Rowling was a known gamer. <laughs> <laughs> I should just go on to Twitter and say hashtag J.K. Rowling gamer. 
Yes. Hashtag uninvited. Hashtag Harry Potter. The mailbox is now closed. You hear, the door swings open with a creak. That's not a creak. There you go. That's a that's an open doorway. Uh oh. As you enter the mansion, the door slams We're caved closed in. behind you. Welcome home. This entrance We're hall is a large, extravagant, luxurious room. Yet it feels. I thought we were oh. playing uninvited, not unentitled. <laughs> Strangely <laughs> oppressive. Okay, oh. so the first thing Look, we need to do is go. Inside. Well, this is already looking good. Demonic imagery. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Look, dude, look, the pentagrams are, looks nice on that carpet. The nah. door is now open. <laughs> this this very, large... very large. Go ahead. You go. Okay. <laughs> this very large room-sized carpet displays a pentagram. The five-pointed star is set against a circular star, star field. Yeah, we're all too polite. Look at that. Look at that. That's the giant bird in the window. Yeah, you start, so I let you. Do, so I let you do it. Besides, I don't want to read that one uh, word. Oh yeah, I already opened the door. Durr. <laughs> Opening the, the door, door that's already, already open. open, doofus. <laughs> open door. This room was designed for deep thought and research. Oh boy, Twilight would have a ball in this place. Mm. Obviously, it was once inhabited by a serious man of letters. The harsh wow. silence in the rest of the house is muted in this room of contemplation. Do you think it was the Count? Yeah, Count Dracula. Yes, the book, book is now open. Two book. The book is open to a page which seems to be filled with definitions. Okay, so this is the point where we have to write down stuff. So... I'll do the honors after. I'll do the honors. Okay. I'll read them off too. Instantum, sudden and momentary. Here are air and gone in an instant. Illuminaris, a bright white light. Let me write that down. Whoops. Uh, nuts. Never Project. mind. I got it. I remember. I memorized it. Okay, that's good. Projectum, the propulsion of an entity. Spirka. A small Project. flame or spark. Spikan, to talk, talking. Hephod, the head, the skull, etc. Magisterium, mystery. Let me write all this down. Magisterium projectum illuminati. I mean, what? Oh, don't uh, forget Abraxas. Abraxas. It is a magical word. A vehicle through which magic is directed. Oh, Abraxas. No. Okay. Uh, Abraxas is magic. Abraxas cadapsers. Magic. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> yes. Okay. okay. Assuming that we got this all noted, we. Why are we reading? I thought we were Keep playing in mind, I didn't write down the de Keep in mind, I didn't write down the definitions, so we might screw up. Oh, Whatever. Okay. Trial and error, folks. No, it's not. Okay, you guys now's, the, looking at a guy now's a good point to save our game. Aesthetic. Yep. Save <laughs> as. Uh, save okay. game as. Unentitled. I am going to put this on the five and a quarter inch disc yes. in slot two. Okay. Slot two. Uh-oh. 91 free of 140. Yep. Uh-oh. We... Okay, D G R R S H four E one one up, and hopefully it'll save it. As it one up. Oh no! You've programmed the game to do something weird. <laughs> and saving the file. And there we go. There is our title of the game name or whatever. Anyways. This room is devoid of any aesthetic warmth or beauty. It is purely functional, with no concern for the tri uh, for the trivialities of interior design. Jeez, wow, I'm these ghosts are real neat freaks. How long is that chilling wing going to cut through your flesh? You can hear Luigi in the background! He's Wait, getting all the booze! <laughs> Wait, why does it say one up right there? Because you put because that's the name he put it with there. Yeah. The door is now open. A the mysterious woman appears. Up. She is dressed like Scarlett O'Hara, and she stands with her back to you. Let's hit her! That's a big butt. No, let's consume her. <laughs> yeah, that would be even better. Oh, you have ah. gotten the attention of the mysterious lady. I thought she had... She turns to face you. Her face is devoid of any flesh. 
You are frozen with horror as she begins ripping your body into a bloody mess. You had the mouse over her eye. I thought there was like a little eye patch of her eyeball still left in there. <laughs> nah, she ain't got nothing. Yep. We're dead. <laughs> She's got nice I've got you! She's got nice hair. I've got you, He-Man! <laughs> yes, I'll use oh, a no. save game. I will load... There, nothing will stop from... me from delivering them to Horrid Prime. The file as slowly as possible. <laughs> now, now one more stop me from developing yeah, this. I've got you. Uh oh. You take programmed that, the game. Okay, let's continue upstairs. Let's Go. try that again. Yeah. Okay, so. <laughs> the old wooden floorboards creak under your weight. Your creaking footsteps echo through the emptiness of the huge house. Open nah. the door. And go right in to the theme. Eventually, we'll go the in. The door is now open. There's an uh -oh. eyeball peeking this in This is a good-sized closet with lots of room for bric-a-brac. Okay, as far as I know, we'll need this, which okay. is a uh, thingamajig. What okay, consume that? cleaning supplies. Wait. Wait, can you actually put this stuff back in this version? I th think you can. Because I know in the NES version you can't. The bottle's label reads, No ghosts for poltergeists, vampires, and other undesirable undead visitors. Wow, how convenient. Yeah. Who keeps on who keeps no ghost in their in their closet? My grandmother the Ghostbusters. does. My, my grandmother <laughs> yeah. does. Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure in the two GS version, same with the Macintosh <laughs> version, you can put you can drop stuff. And put stuff back and stuff, so Yeah, okay, well who's she uh, keeping out with all the with all the no ghosts? The Green Reaper. Damn it! I was kind of hoping you'd say grandpa. <laughs> okay, spider sight. Okay, let's open it up. Okay, I've been called heroes. I know. That's why you should have said it. The bottle is now open. I'm not As that you cold like you. Small bottle. A foul odor bombards your olfactory senses. The liquid contents of this nearly empty bottle produce a smell similar to that of an injured skunk. It reminds you of the smell of decay that surrounds the house itself. Why is there an injured skunk? And Why does that it is, matter? <laughs> that is all we can do right here. Let's, uh... Why does that got... fish have a dog head? Consume the shark. <laughs> Lols. Okay, is... so... The oh, door the battle is axe. Now open. contains an uh, old rickety spiral staircase that spins up towards the next level. The thunder from the, the storm thunder... outside crescendos, then dies out again. Kaboom! Not again. And we'll take the axe because we're psychopaths. Gilius is, yeah, let's take Gilius's axe. Gilius and is save it again. Boy. God, we're and saving everything. Let's go up the stairs. You better yes. hurry up because you know this is a time limit video game. Yeah. Yeah. yeah in the yeah, NES yeah. version, that time limit doesn't exist, that's but what, in this that, version, it does. That's what makes this game so this exciting. Is, this room is bitterly cold, like that joke you just made. The iron bars which form the cell are like rods of ice, just like my soul. Ooh. Firmly implanted in both the floor and ceiling, just like the cruelty that I gave to one up there, which was totally Screw undeserved. Screw you, okay? <laughs> Open. I said, which was totally undeserved. You pull in the cell hey. door until the cold iron finally gives way. A hideous figure in the shape of a decapitated peasant forms inside the cell. The severed head speaks as it hangs from its hair. There is no escape from here. There is only one sentence in the cell. An eternal life sentence. There is no escape. No escape. I can't walk away, just echo. No escape. No escape. No escape. No escape. Okay. Okay. I think the echo well, is on. we're screwed. <laughs> As you enter the cage, you hear the door slam shut behind you. There is no escape. You are trapped here for eternity. Eventually, you die and your flesh decays, greatly adding to the old mansion's atmosphere. Atmosphere. <laughs> I've got you! Now yeah. nothing will stop me from delivering you to Horde Prime! So you had an axe on you, yet you never decided to actually try and break the, the bars, huh? <laughs> well, well, they're both... We have, we're playing as a beautiful mind right here. Well, we're, they're both probably made of the same type of metal, so probably... Okay, would be... So eventually I you'd don't, wear don't it don't out. The, door the, top. the axe or the bars? The frickin' wood floor! 
<laughs> oh no! This wood, this 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 thing is put onto a wood floor. How do you know? The you... most unbreakable of floors. You don't know what's underneath the wood floor, though. Another you... floor! <laughs> You're on the Did second you... floor. You went up a staircase. This. I didn't get to read what it said. Okay, that's fine. You'll see My in the video. star is gone, but not lost. Master's servant will pay for his indiscretion. The vehicle of my power has not yet served its purpose. When it sets me free, I will have a chance to re realize my unlimited... Potential. Potential. The forces of the technological society will be unprepared for the likes of me. I will not be denied. My omnipotence is inevitable. Oh I my I god. Open this. Don Delancey is pissed. <laughs> yes, <laughs> I can. Uh, open the scroll the nightstand and is now let's open. examine it. Are you Discord? Discord, I'm howling at the spoon. Wait, what? What? On the old paper, there are but six words spread over two lines. It reads, Speak on Hephod Abraxas and Instanum Illuminaris Abraxas. Let me so, write down those. Okay, yeah, let's take let me write, those. Let me write down those combos. Speak magic. Let me write down those combos. Yeah. Speak, speak to magic. the head. Yeah, speak, speak to, to the, the head. Speak to the magic head. Yes. Speak and to the head! Instantly light magic. Mm -hmm. Oh wait, no, that's not. It's not has fought. It's he fought. Half fought. He, he fought, and the masters head. of this universe. Head, face, and etc. Head, face, knees, etc. 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 Okay, so we got speak on head foot abraxas or whatever. Uh, instantium luminary. Speak on head foot abraxas. Yes. Okay, so assuming, we got, so assuming that we got those, we'll just close this for we now, do. and we, we will... Do. Okay, you're lonely, whatever. <laughs> Go. Lone? Get out of here. The story of our lives. Nor hide nor hair of him in quite a while. He should be somewhere on this estate. You better find him. Yeah, he's dead. <laughs> for all we know. He's the fish. My parents are dead. The old wooden floorboards creak under your weight. Your creaking footsteps echo through, and then fuck you. The door is now open. Look, another book! It arrives. This must be the master bedroom. Interesting decor. There is a stale smell about this room, as if it hadn't been open for years. <laughs> okay. It's better than opening Open a room book. and it's smelling like poop. The book is now open. <laughs> <laughs> Greetings, fellas, diary and welcome reads. to Let's Play Let's Read Some Books. This or diary whatever. reads, I have lost control of Draken. My star student now fancies himself a master. Though his power is strong, his spirit is weak. He is easily corrupted by the dark spirits of greed and... And that's it. <laughs> power. And power. My servant, more aware than I, sealed his star in my hingeless box. They're locked away beyond his stair. I've hidden the key. A chair knows where. Okay, Ooh. chair, tell us where it is! <laughs> Stephen Hawking's, where did you put it? Me, me. I've oh. hidden the key. A chair That's knows where. Stephen Hawkins. There's not a keyboard on there. Now I'm just imagining. Uh, what? You yeah. now have to question the reliability of your eyes. You think you see a somewhat cute, abstract creature with a key in its hand prance by. You're not sure whether it's your eyes or your mind playing tricks on you. It could be both. I see you get for consuming a... so much stuff. It was a Keiko demon. <laughs> Yeah, if I remember okay. correctly, I think that's the Cookie Monster. Not again. Okay, let's... Hmm. Remember to open somebody's, up the fart. Somebody's, somebody's oh. doing a grill outside somewhat. Open up the fart In the middle of the night? Away. Either, that or, either that or it's called the Cookie Imp. There's the chilling wind again. Yeah. Okay, oh, so now we're ready out. to kill her once oh, and for all. Open it up. Open it first. Let's kill Scarlet O'Hara! Yep, just shove it up her bum. <laughs> you just say that as I roll my mouse over there, over it, and click. You pour the foul-smelling <laughs> liquid on the head of the overdressed guest. The liquid seems to burn as it drips over her. The bell lets out a horrifying scream as she appears to melt helplessly. Suddenly, the inner lit. The bottle is now empty. The evil air that pervades the estate seems to have infiltrated your very being. Your head and chest feel heavy and thick. You find it increasingly difficult to ex execute your will. For a minute, your thoughts seem inf seemed influenced by another. Mind. M mind. So, 
let's go ahead and yeah you're slowly say, starting to go insane do you feel how do you feel like Dorothy and a dog it makes no sense and a little dog too <laughs> How do you feel like a dog? How do you feel like a dog? Was your tail wagging when she was melting or something? The one with the waggly tail. Ding dong, the witch is dead. Oh, come on. How much is that dog in the window? <laughs> At that one moment, didn't I forget the rest of the lyrics? This parlor has lost its original charm. The cracked, dirty walls are testament to the estate's state of disrepair. All right, let's open this door and go right outside onto the porch. Consume porch. From oh, here you have the splendid the of, the of the desolate estate. A large black spider quickly runs by you along the railing. Okay, <laughs> Quick, grab so... the axe quickly, skillet. <laughs> yeah, no, let's do it with the axe. Yeah, no, blow. no. What we're gonna do more effectively is operate it on this thing because we might actually use it later. So a wide we're gonna aerosol. Yeah, a wide aerosol stream sprays from the spider cider can. Making the thing wet and sticky. Yes. Uh, and let's go back outside and hey, voila! Spider. Got ya. <sighs> the itsy bitsy spider fell off the railway shaft. The spider becomes paralyzed as it comes into contact with the spider cider. It. Here's that chilling wind. It's not dead, but it's not going anywhere without your help. Okay, so, so it takes we're spider. grabbing it. Like the villager, you will pocket a spider. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Pretty much, and then sh and then show it off as soon as you kill a guy in a tunic. Okay, so Shh, Mario, no spoilers. We'll do it later. <laughs> can't wait to. Throw God, this what was the? Hey. I didn't know there was a butler ghost in this house. I can't okay, wait to throw this. Okay, so oh, we see a head here. So why don't we try our one whatever little spell? Yeah, one of our little spells. Okay, so speak on. It's pro. Hefford. Uh, Braxis. You didn't capitalize it, it's not gonna work. Who cares? The game cares, apparently. Uh oh. You made the statue dark. <laughs> That's not good. Is... Uh. What just happened? See what happens when you didn't capitalize uh... it? I told you Doom Guy was programming the video game as he's playing it. So apparently, speaking to a freaking statue allows the game to crash. Yeah, that's. I don't funny. think that's the right statue, anyways. But then again, I yeah, could be it's wrong. not the right statue. Yeah, because you didn't, yeah, you didn't capitalize it. He ignored you. Bad grammar. I don't think that's entirely necessary at this point. Oh, no. Actually, you're not. It. You're not using grammar. You're you're, you're speaking. It's okay. Well, you're not putting enough emphasis on the beginning letter. Okay. Oh wow, your your grammar is terrible, Mario. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Okay, anyways, uh, uh, just referring back to the uh, note where it once said, I forgot the quote, but you can see that right here. What but the heck yes. is a Wario symbol on that couch? <laughs> but yeah, anyways, we operate the axe on, I believe it's this chair right here. Are you sure? And voila, a key. Boom. As you rip through the fine upholstery, you discover a golden skeleton key. All right, it's so gold and it's Dookie Brown. Why do I have a feeling that that was where the inspiration for that key at the beginning of Octavia and the Underworld's cello came from? Oh, hmm. uh, maybe I don't know. Yeah. Uh oh, someone's. Okay. Um, I believe we go in through this way next. You two replay, by the way. Anyways, let's go in the blue door. Ooh, really a rec room. Him. This looks like a room designed for fun and games. It seems out of place on this gloomy estate. Mm. Oh yay! Oh. One up. You want to face me in chess? No, no, yeah. I don't. No, I don't Ooh, want to. Ooh, look at this! Too. Look at this little oldie. Just examine. Want to dance? Don't examine it. No. Ro Until Rock now, you had only seen a gramophone in the movies. This record player has no electronic parts. It consists of a crankshaft, a nail of a needle, and a comb-like horn for a speaker. Rocks can't dance. 
on the platter is a 78 RPM copy with a magnifty label of Rudy Valley singing Winchester Cathedral. Let's hear it. Oh no, no, no. No. Wow, that's the best music ever. Uh, that's a shame. As the old Victrola spews out its sounds, a problem occurs within, causing the record to start skipping, and soon, the old mainspring snaps with a loud POP! Anyway, that <laughs> that's not a pop. Yeah, a loud pop. That I was just a hear... fuss de raw, more like Yeah, I, he I actually heard that from the 2GS. That's not a loud pop, that's a click. That was a click that's I just a... heard. Is that... yeah, you call like... that a loud pop? Developers. Anyway, that Rudy Valley sure had a snazzy sound. <laughs> that was your pop. Yeah. Oh, it's heard. locked. Oh, we do have a key, though. The cabinet won't open. It is locked. Oh, not for long. Better use my key. Better use the spider. Let's shove the spider uh, into the keyhole, and the spider will open it from the inside. Merge uh, what? Spy Did you put it out of range? Okay, now what? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just operate the key onto the door. And open. The cabinet is now unlocked. And open. we got... A doll? Uh, there's this the, dude the again. The smiling, key-bearing creature prances quickly past you again. He grins childishly as if taunting you. Yes. You pull out your spider and wing it at yep, him. Yep, that's the cookie, Em. <laughs> Alright. So, what did you find? A doll? This doll. Yeah. Oh no, Mimsy? it's it's Jennifer. The yeah. little doll is a small reproduction of a gypsy fortune teller. Jennifer was not a gypsy. Why are you putting your dolls in the closet, Rockridge? Hmm. Jokes on you, I don't have any <laughs> clock tower that merchandise. That dude just walked right by again. That was definitely not your imagination. This little creature is definitely running circles around you. It disappears eh, as quickly as it appears. It moves too fast for you to react to it. He wants Sonic. He okay, so move. here is the dining room. I'm oh, gonna save this right is an here. impressive sight. You could throw a terrific birthday bash in this room. The odor of stale wine still permeates the air. Why do I feel like you're putting a pinky epicent on some birthday party? Oh, we got some flowers here. I actually Let's did think of that, but I wasn't trying to do Let's a pinky emphasis. And um, I believe we go through here. So is that the is that all the head you're supposed to talk to? Go. The set of double doors is now open. I can attest. I've actually played the NES. It's cold in here. There is no central heating in this old gothic mansion. The curved outer wall of this room is exposed to the elements in three directions. It is colder in here than it is outside. And slight pause. Yeah, slight pause. There is no fireplace. It must be awful during the winter. Yeah. Must it be awful during the winter? It's freaking cold outside, man. Oh, yeah. Well, why is it cold? Because, because it is. Because it's not spring, apparently. Oh, yeah, because it is. That's the best reason. Yeah. Yeah, Yay, I win points. Nothing. Okay, so... The desk is now open. Okay, what the so heck apparently... Did you find? Index okay. cards. Okay. This card reads HG Mercury number 80. This metal appears to be a liquid when it is in its solid state. This silvery liquid-like metal reacts visibly to changes in temperature. Okay, so as a dangerous cumulative. Okay, so okay, a mer mercury is eighty. If taken, effective taken internally. Okay, let me type that down. Okay. Oh, for Pete's sake! <laughs> <laughs> okay, silver. Gold is going to be in there somewhere. Uranium? No. We're not making atomic bonds. Thank you very much. Hey. Sorry about that, folks. A friend called. You don't make Okay, so, uh, do we have everything? Okay, cool. Do we gold. have everything? 79. Down? Okay, so it's 80, 40. Forgot the second number. 47. 80, 47. Okay, 32. 80, 47, 79. Okay, 32, so. 32, hike. Take those to note. Alright, so now that that business is taking, taking <sighs> care of, we can continue. Let's get the cars and scram. Alright, so again. let's open this, because I believe we need to be in here as well. Open. <laughs> the set of the double set doors of double is, now, is now, open. now open. Okay, the kitchen. Upon oh, entering no. the kitchen, you realize that this room is probably the most modern room in the house. 
After all, it appears to have been remodeled sometime this century. What Is century are you living in? That looks like an old stove. No, it's Rice Krispie Treats on the stove. See, we get them. Rice Krispie <laughs> Treats, yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, now we're in the pantry. Um, do we need anything out of this? Oh, oh we do need these. Rusty and stuffy. Patches of wallpaper are missing in several spots. This tiny little room does not fit in with the rest of this sprawling, pal unpalatial estate. Okay, so we have this box of matches. So, okay, let's just oh, go dear. back for now. Oh, I know what we're going to do. We're going to light this spider on fire like an ara arachnophobia. <laughs> Wait, what? Yeah, uh, <laughs> well, not precisely, but we're going to do something about the spider, and you'll see pretty soon. We're going to throw it at yeah, the We're going to throw, throw, throw it at something. <laughs> Whoever had occupied this room must have been satisfied with small accommodations. This room does not seem quite as untidy as the rest of the house. You see no dust or cobwebs. Uh oh. Okay, so. Gasper, is this your room? No. Oh no. I know what happens in here if you're not careful. Yeah. Oh. Jeez. As you turn on the lamp, you see the picture on the wall slide to your left. Ooh! Oh, look. look at that. Hello look at there, that. Buster Brown. Your tired eyes are having trouble focusing on the ghostly figure before you. Oh, you're tired. Oh, no. Uh-oh. An angry man's spirit hovers in chains in front of you. The ghost speaks. This is my room. Who let you in here? These are not the master's things. They're mine. 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 Mine, 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 mine. there's too many mines. Mine sweeper. Mine sweeper. Mine Throw sweeper. spider at ghosts. Mine sweeper. <laughs> Throw a doll at ghosts. Well, Dolphins first we're gonna do disguise. something incredibly stupid, and that is to challenge. Well, actually, no. Consume. Would, no, consume him. Consume the ghost. Consume. The I must ghost eat you. Hard to swallow. <laughs> you should not eat the ghost. The ghost would be hard to swallow. How would it be hard to swallow? They're, they're like ecto cooler. <laughs> you should not consume the. Well, fine, I'll hit you. You should. I'll hit you. Your punch you swishes punch wildly and through the air. I'll consume your book. Ha ha ha. Om nom nom. Good piece of literature. Ah! Many apparitions misty form engulfs you, and you become covered in a thick, sticky, protoplasmic goo. It burns like acid. The pain is soon too much, and f flesh. Yes. Soon too much for your flesh. Pretty much. And soon it eats away your flesh. And and now I've got you. Yes. Uh oh. Okay. Oh, hey. This time, time we're gonna do things right. This time. Consume spider, it'll scare the ghost away. <laughs> I'm, this, I'm, I'm this daring. Hey, ghost, watch this! <laughs> Wait a minute. You should not eat the spider. Get out of here, you! No, use the spider on the ghost. Yeah, I know, I know. No, put... <laughs> throw put, the spider right, the ghost's let's there. do it. Put spider on his book. <laughs> See a ghost... Hope you like my spider. The possessive ghost shrieks at the sight of the stunned spider. Flustered and frightened, the spirit dissolves from view, leaving you again alone. Don't you mean alone again? Eh, let's no, leave it in this bed. didn't do it. <laughs> leaving you again alone. Story of lives. Forever alone, ghost. <laughs> Your diary, the diary is now open. This diary reads, The master would or could not. So I have stolen Dracon's star. He is an evil soul. Unlike the master, he uses his power for amusement and profit. He is Ooh. not concerned with mortal needs, spiritual enlightenment. <laughs> there is no compassion with his power. I grow weak. I am dying. I have hidden the star in master's special box. It never <laughs> opens. It has no locks. Dracon's star never discerns. In fire, it freezes. In ice, it burns. That gives us clues here. So, let's head back yeah. upstairs. Carry on my wayward son. <laughs> okay. I think we go this... Yes, we go this way. Good. I was right. Yay! Uh, nuts, the hall. nuts, 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 uh, upstairs, upstairs, come you on. You gaze at the Wario symbol that's engraved in the couch. Uh, okay, and right in here. This looks like Wario's house. It's like a thing. Oh, geez, freaking Markiplier. 
The emptiness of the huge house. Okay, so I believe we can use the key on this uh, wardrobe right now. The key cannot be opened. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> trying to open the key? No. Yeah, open key. Use on wardrobe. Okay, operate on Well, wardrobe. you know what's funny? In uh, Resident Evil, you can open up a key, and it turns into a different key. Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay, so, oh, we more. got the hingelets box. Remember the uh, diary? Yeah. The diary, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, the diary. Yeah, there you go. Okay, so there's some important stuff for us to read. No, nope, screw you. No one cares. Is... Ah, yeah. Really? Ah, d d d d okay, come on. The cabinet's already open. I'm trying to click on... There you go. I know. It is a large, heavy chest with two doors. We know this. Ah, come on. Uh... Okay, open scroll. Open scroll, yeah. and now examine. Move this. The old papyrus reads, The heart of the garden maze contains the blot on the Blothny gem. There are certain places you cannot go till you unlock the mystery. Mm -hmm. Gold, silver, mercury. Bingo! Gotcha! GSM. Together they form a key. I was right. Okay, so, it's guaranteed that we won't screw up this time. Okay, so close the cabinet, and let's get out of here. Yeah, yeah, you're worried about your brother. Just keep going, you. Scaredy cat. Coward. Cowardly scaredy cat. Okay, so. Let's go ahead and open the matchbox and strike our match here. Come on. Match. Come on. <laughs> do not do not consume. No, consume. Uh, you uh, fuck. Light a fire in your stomach. I don't care. Good gosh. Okay, this is becoming a pain to oh. Come on. There you go. Okay. So, strike a match. Dude. Operate it <laughs> in the fireplace. Now, we are going to put the box in the fireplace. Whoosh. Boom. Now it's not so... Boom. That, that it's all... Oh, no. no. That's all blah. As you, as you press the... As you push the... As you toss the box into the fire, a as large... You push, the box. Of smoke <laughs> out. you push the box. <laughs> push the box into the fire. Whatever. As the smoke clears, you notice a brass pentagram that apparently survived the burning of the box. Well, of course, yeah. it froze. Okay, so let's go ahead. Naturally, and... before has now gone out. Okay, so let's go right back. Um, let's save this right here. I need to think for a moment. Um, I don't. I don't believe we need to go. Yeah, we don't need to go anywhere else. I think we got everything we need. To, we need to get here. So let's cool. co let's 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 go onward. Hopefully, we're not forgetting anything. No, At least, hopefully. Everything. Okay, this cage will be useful. So oh no, that bear's around. gonna attack. So, let's grab the cage. Ooh, rifles. We literally just took a cage. Yeah, Nicholas Cage. The rifle is locked in the gun rack. Oh, Obviously, God, the owner was, was so concerned bad. about safety and didn't want just anyone playing with the rifles. I seriously would want one of those because that would prove useful into killing any ghost that dare cross my path. This isn't our first. Did you just say that? Did you just say I want a rifle to shoot a ghost? <laughs> <laughs> this large expanse of backyard reminds you of the Wizard of Oz. Hello, the Yellow Brick Road. No, it reminds me of the Three Little Pigs. Okay, how many references of Wizard of Oz we've seen so far? Well, Only three. Two. Two. Yeah, two. Well, th well, three if. You three. Well. Yeah, three, I think. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Really? I only remember Dorothy and the Little Dog. <laughs> Wait, Dorothy and the Little Dog? Isn't that just... Oh! That's... Looky, looky. Uh-oh. You stand before a large, jewel-studded entrance. The wind attacks your exposed flesh. Ears, fingers, and your nose are the premier casualties. Oh, uh, so, yeah, you can't, you can't feel, hear, or smell. As you approach the chapel entrance, you are confronted by two menacing dogs. The vicious canines block your path, teeth bared and snarling. 
As the dogs look you over, they begin sal unsalivating profusely. It seems an appropriate response to your arrival. Okay, consume dog. Yeah, that'll work. Wait a minute, isn't there like a phrase you're supposed to speak to them? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, I think there's a phrase we're supposed to do, but uh... Yeah. EAT THE DOG! <laughs> Sorry, this isn't a different country. <laughs> the dogs don't think you should play with them. They're not in the mood for love. One sinks its fangs into your forearm as the other goes straight for your throat. The three of you roll around, biting... Where are you boy is he biting back? Kicking and scratching until the dogs manage to sever your jugular vein. The life force quickly abandons your being as you are reduced to dog food. Yeah. Oh. And this guy was carrying around an axe the entire time. <laughs> could have easily killed them. Yes, he didn't. yes. This he guy's a pet. Yes, he could kill one and the other could go straight for him and just kill him. Yeah, this is just horrible. Yeah, you do have a point. This is horrible earthbound logic. Pretty much, yeah. Runaway dog, a uh, runaway dog. Run you no. just killed it. No, runaway feral dog. Okay, so the most proper way to do this is to do this one spell. What the instantaneum Illuminaris Abraxas one? Yes. Yes. Okay, so how to spell it out? Uh, I n s t a n t u m. Uh, Space and a, oh, oh, you have this, don't you? Illuminaris Abraxas, is that right? Yeah, that's it. Okay, here it goes. Oh, the game froze. <laughs> nope. Dogs went bye bye. Now we can go inside. And at you the did utterance the of these magic words comes a blinding bull of lightning and blast of thunder. As the, at this, the dogs recoil. They put their tails between their legs and scamper across the grounds of the estate. From now, you ha you now have access to the chapel door. From now on, you might want to watch where you step. No doubt. No. <laughs> just a just a just a little word of advice that you might want to take into consideration. Okay, so you stand in solemn awe in this abandoned house of worship. In the silence, you can hear the prayers of righteous predecessors. You feel the presence of many long-dead worshippers. You feel... Oops, uh, continue. Sorry. You feel a yourself stranger, a stranger. stranger, yet you feel protected. Yet you feel protected, yes. Okay, so, there's quite a number of things we can do here. Um, there's the head again. We can, uh, speak to it. Yeah, we can talk to that. Yeah, that one we can talk to. Yeah. Spacon, he, he fought a Braxis. He fucks a Braxis. <laughs> yes. Wouldn't that be cool? Pecan, he, he food a Brucis. A Bruce the Willis. Oh, no, yes. no, no. People don't know about that yet. Bruce the Willis. We Master, have it up please that open the side door for this poor family man, but do not let him travel in darkness. Okay, thanks. Latu oh, Barata. <laughs> Master, please open thy door for this poor family man. But do not let him travel in darkness. <laughs> <laughs> and as that, the vacuum cleaner goes off. And it goes off. No. Oh no, the, the statue's vacuuming up all your stuff. <laughs> Where'd I do? I just love that moment. Just cut you off. <laughs> Okay, what? let's go ahead and... I thought you cut you off! Uh oh Okay, uh... The chilling wind is not like your echo effect, Rock. Okay, strike... Hey, I was reading it in a moany voice. It didn't like that, apparently. The only moan you're gonna hear is the wind. Okay, the only moan you will hear is wind. Ah, crap! Ah, uh, shit! Uh... Chapel does not catch on fire. <laughs> <laughs> what? Well, yeah, that... Burn down the church. No, <laughs> you like the yeah, that'll be the great. Flame. Burn down no, the entire church. <laughs> this isn't the Sims, Doom guy. You can't just. Uh, do good that. grief. Uh, okay. So I can close this. The and light your is... entire matchbox on. Uh oh. Fire. Again, the evil that dwells within the estate vies for control of your spirit. Its influence grows more and more. Powerful. 
Soon you will not have the strength of mind to fight it off. You can feel that the spirits collected here are anxiously anticipating your induction. Okay, so... I didn't want to be inducted into the United States Armed Forces! Yeah, yeah, whatever. And a match you lit before has now consumed your entire matchbox. Okay, so... Okay, the cage the is now open. Oops. Uh. Okay, well, we don't need these. We can ditch these out. Let's see if we can throw in, throw in the cage this time. There you go. That's better. Okay. Yay. And let's save our game. Better hurry How up are you fitting all these in your pockets? He's not. He's carrying it around like um, like Joel does in uh, what's it called, uh, The Last of Us. Yeah. They're all in. They're all in his backpack. Okay, grab the cross because it seems useful. Ooh. Ah. Oh no! You opened the secret passageway for holding a cross. Devil's coming up. Yep. As you move the cross, you see the altar move to the side. Okay, let's go back, because I believe I forgot something. I just went over there like like an idiot. Okay, what are you so, talking about? So, always... let's go into the greenhouse, because there are some things that we need to do. Yeah. Like, look, look murder those dogs. Mm -hmm. They're already walking down my street. No. Uh -oh. Don't you wish there's someone walking down your street? The steel and glass structure must have once housed a multitude of life forms. <laughs> now body corpses and have a shallow clay graves. Oh god, apparently the plants are like restless tonight. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I know I know when I don't water my plants, I hear in the middle of the night <laughs> <laughs> on my door. I'm hungry! Water <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so it seems it seems living organisms don't do too well on this estate. Whoever lived here must have had a gold touch, but no green thumb. Okay, let's examine this. Oh, there's something that can be grown into this, and there goes the vacuum cleaner. <laughs> <laughs> the faint <Let's> wings. <laughs> it, it is large. Water streams from the can into the hardened, cracked soil. The dry dirt quickly sucks up the liquid nourishment. This potted plant was obviously in desperate need of a drink. Okay, so out. we're pretty much set here, so let's just, just go just, inside here. Just put in the title. Right inside just, here. just put in the title. Chilling wind interrupts all. <laughs> no, he's going to be back for the plant that has an apple growing out of it. Okay, let's save our game right here because we've done what we can at this point. And... In a, in a desperate search for his brother, the protagonist will water plants and play with candelabras. Yes. Okay, let's see what's down this trap door. A trap. Uh, okay. Look, you really don't want to go down there. There is a spider down there that's bigger than a bread box. Uh, -oh. uh. Really, that spider is bad news. Don't try to go down there. Go. This is a warning. Don't try to go down there again. Yeah, I'll go down there. The spider that's down there would rip you to shreds. Don't try to go down there. No, I could take him. I have an axe. Yeah, screw it. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Ooh! You idiot! No, it's not that big. This dark gaping hole reminds you of something from a Freudian nightmare. Wow, way to be funny. I would have laughed if they made a Harry Potter. Well, now reference. you know. There really is a spider to beware of. And a yeah. very big one at that. Oh, oh, this is, this this is cave is inhabited by a giant arachnid. Its eight la large hairy legs stick into the mud. In a moment, the huge creature attacks you from above. It crushes your tiny body in its large, powerful jaws. Yeah, remember when that happened to Harry Potter? <laughs> yep. I've got you. Alright, so, let's go ahead yeah, and go that. this way. Now, why is there a giant demonic spider in the church? Oh, oh. there's the ghost! Hey, well, ghost. Not Bye, you. ghost. Ooh, I am not made of mammoth paint. Ooh. That was the scariest paper mache ghost uh, I ever seen. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> you are standing on a path that leads up to a large stone structure. Beyond the structure, you see a forest that looks as if it has been ravaged. That has been like it looks as if it has been ravaged by decay. Rubbed edge by decay. Rubbed edge by decay. Perfect. As you leave the chapel, a strange ghost flies over you. It does not attack you. The glow of the candles dims the presence of the ghost. It is offended by the flames and flies off to its supernatural home. <laughs> I just imagine it going back to its home and it's just a bird feeder. <laughs> yeah, <pretty much. laughs> We've had trouble were... with haunted bird feeders in the state. <laughs> <laughs> you are uneasy about continuing through this eerie labyrinth. The farther you go, it seems, and it seems the farther you have to go. No, okay, like I think yeah. Comes another death. Yeah, considering that this maze is going to be rather amazing. <laughs> yeah, pretty much, but in reality, convoluted <laughs> because yeah, it's all over the place. It's a freaking maze, and unfortunately, I don't have uh. a map with me. So I think this is a good time as any to call it a part here. So next time. We will gather up a map for this maze and continue on through and hopefully get through the rest of the game and see how it fares out. So, yes, yeah. thank you guys for watching. This has been, well, this has been part one of Uninvited for the Apple II GS. This is Doomguy the Second saying goodnight. How come we never do the rest of our shows? <laughs> <laughs> okay, fine. Mario Brother, I went up saying what? Oh, shit! <laughs> 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 okay. Bye -bye. Worst we play ever. Later, guys. No, it's not. Okay, let's go. You're incorrect. My name's Jennifer. Why is right, a people? In a hole. <laughs> <laughs> well, my apologies. Because it's Grand Theft Auto. Hey, they're stealing your computers. <laughs> yeah, it's Grand Theft Auto. Wait, did you did you seriously just throw down a dollar for the pimp in the hole? Okay, let's just take a look at the control panels and see if the mouse is sped up. Is it sped up? Yes, I'm probably going to need a mouse pad. I don't have one right now, but whatever. Who cares? You don't... It's Speed a point-and-click game. You don't need it! <laughs> You're not playing Doom.